it about Derek that has him being strict with everyone in the group? Um, I think Derek um, is, you know, he's put in an unfortunate position. You know, he's he has to become the leader of the group. So for him, you know, he has like all this responsibility with, you know, his fellow, you know, group members. You know, um, with him, he he, you know, when the world ended, he wasn't expected to somehow become a leader of the group. So. You know, it's just he had to pick it up really quick, learn from trial and error, and, you know, that's why I feel like he's very moody at the times, you know, he's very upset or, you know, like not very social because of just the stress that he has, the, the whole feeling of how do I keep this group alive, how do I motivate them to keep going, you know. So I feel like that's why, you know, Derek is the way he is, you know, he's just put in a position where it's a little bit tough on him. Yeah, okay. And what is it like working on something small like this as opposed to something bigger like Jurassic World or The Fifth Wave, both of which you were in? Um, I guess it's just like, besides obviously being smaller, uh, it's, you know, it's more time to socialize with your fellow co-stars and, you know, people that are in the crew. In big productions, you normally don't get that kind of opportunity because it's constantly, you know, takes after takes. And with this, you know, you get to socialize more, get to know each other a little bit more. Um, again, like Annie said, it's it's stressful, but you know, at the end of the day, you you try to have it, you, you know, be fun and energetic, and be pleasant with everybody. And you know, it's independent and independent filmmaking. You know, it's a lot of more work, really. Uh, you know that you're doing with as a group, you know, as opposed to a whole studio production. So that's the way I see. It. I mean, other than that, everything else is pretty pretty similar. Okay. And what is it like working with this cast and crew? Uh, fa awesome. It's fabulous. I mean, I'd say they're brilliant. Uh, you know, to me, I look up to all these actors, to the, all these, you know, um, crew members, you know, they're all fantastic people, you know, it's a great opportunity to be working with them. You know, um, you learn something from a little bit from everybody, you know, even in the young kids, you know, you see their energetic and their childhood and you, you know, you feel like that's something that you can always bring on set, you know, that, that motivation with everybody else that is older, your crew members, you know, the, how responsible they are and how serious they are when it comes to this, all of that, you know, I, I like that because it keep, keeps things flowing and it's more, more entertaining. Great. And can you tell me who directed this movie? Yeah, so we actually have this awesome director named Richard Kim. Uh, I had the pleasure of working with Richard Kim in the past, and so when I called him up for this, you know, I thought he would be a great choice Richard. for directing. So, you know, I, I feel like Richard can bring something that's going to be entertaining and changing for, you know, everybody that watches the He's film. a student right now, right? He is a student at uh, New York University. Oh, great. And uh, the producer of this movie, who is that? Producer of this movie is Isidro Tapia. He's also one of my greatest friends here. He's also the one that helped me yeah. write this. And, you know, we talked about it over the time. And, you know, one of the things we talked about was who can be producer and, you know, take a little bit of charge and command when it comes to being on set. And I, the first person that came up to mind was Isidro. You know, he has that quality of professionalism and getting stuff moving and going. <laughs> and, and, you know, and to me, you know, I, I see like Isidro as, you know, not only, I guess you can call the technical term producer, but also, you know, a guidance and a helper and a friend and, a, you know, someone that's there to support. And I look for stuff like that in people that I work with and, you know, and I'm glad Isidro came on board and he made this thing come to life with the help of everybody. That's great. Did you have to prep a lot for this? position as producer? A lot of money. <laughs> a lot of money and a lot of permits. A lot of paperwork. So you so you basically were in charge of just the entire production for sure. Yeah, I gotta thank Sand also helping out helping me out through all this stuff. Well congratulations on a wonderful movie. Um, we hope to see some future works of you guys of what you guys have planned. And thank you very much for your time and